Gue kok bouncer sebar, bye. Hey guys, what is up? Gabriel Manuel here. Today's video is not a typical lo-fi video that I often upload in here, nor an unedited life update, although it's kind of bit of a one. So in today's video, all I want to do is to talk and talk and talk and talk on how this channel is doing so far. But first, if you really don't know me, especially those who happen to watch this unintentionally because um, Mr. YouTube recommend this video to you, well, I'm so sorry. And at the same time, welcome. <laughs> welcome to my channel. <laughs> so just a brief history about this channel. Um, I joined YouTube last June 2016 because I wanted to share my skits in the platform. Back then, I'm a really big fan of Mr. Well Ukat, also known as Medyo Maldito, because I'm a witness of his growth. He certainly uploaded his videos on Facebook, so that's why I was thinking that time to like, um, why not have my break here on YouTube? Back then, I was not yet familiar on how algorithm works and on how long an ideal video would be. So I uploaded my first vid last July 5, 2016 with the title Gipa Krakunimo. It was also the same year when I went to senior high school and then this channel became a channel where I uploaded my video requirements. I can still remember how proud I am making this video because um, my teacher gave us an A plus for the output. <laughs> Fast forward to 2019, the year when I decided to try my luck to transfer in UP Diliman to shift BA film but um, unluckily it didn't went well. That's one of the main reasons why I started my life update vlog series wherein I talk to my camera on almost a day-to-day -day basis about the things that I've learned on that certain day. I only upload raw videos back then because for me, who even on earth watch my videos? <laughs> Weeks after, I noticed a rise in the number of views in my videos, which is kind of weird because it means somebody out there is watching my and edited, boring, wrong grammar, <laughs> dull, shaky vids. But hey, <laughs> your boy look it up in a way like, dude, why not try making better content? <laughs> Yo. <laughs> so I decided to do some minor editing in my videos and I sometimes even write its flow so that I can have a much organized content. Twas May 2020 when we managed to comply the first requirement on monetizing a YouTube channel. Like, um, we reached our first 1,000 subscribers. Yay! <laughs> From then, I told myself to upload often, but I don't know what to upload anymore since I've been stuck in the dorm because of the pandemic. So I decided to upload lo-fi videos. Right now, this channel already have 32 lo-fi videos. Yes, dude, Brad, Parrot, Chong, what's up? I mean, yes, that much. <laughs> Lol. Kidding aside, it was October when I received a confirmation from YouTube that my channel is finally monetized and now earning. I almost cried that time, yo, and it can clearly be seen in my IG stories. <laughs> Finally, after months and months of YouTube uploads, fruits are starting to appear and um, even though I can still harvest the fruit at the moment, I still consider it as an achievement. You know what I'm saying, right? <laughs> well, um, aside from creating a better intro and learning how to play the basic of lighting the room well, I realized that I don't have a niche yet, so maybe that is one of the many things that I need to work out for this channel to improve. You know, I am thinking of narrowing down the categories of the videos that I'll be filming and uploading here next year. Um, lately, I found myself deeply interested in personal finance, personal growth, and aesthetics. So I was thinking, why not upload videos that are closely related to this? That would be better then for sure. Well, I am not saying to suddenly stop giving you guys the usual videos that you folks enjoy. I mean, as much as I can, I want to do it in a gradual way as possible. And I hope you all still stay with me along this journey. Like, um, I hope you guys will still be happy for me about this one. Hey, we're family, you know? Yo, it's not like I'm not growing because I only do this and that. It's more of a me trying to make bigger steps in moving forward. 
so that we can take things to the next level. As I think about it over and over again, it feels like the only reason why I'm so G with this lo-fi thing is that the effort needed to produce such content is so minimal. It's like, go get a camera, put it on a tripod, let it record for half an hour, insert a lo-fi music on it, then boom, you're good to go. Well, if that's the case, then I can't polish my passion in filmmaking. I don't need to think of a punchline for you guys to enjoy. I'm not improving my skills in editing. It doesn't help me boost my confidence in public speaking. You know, I fail to grab the chance to be better because all I did was staying in my comfort zone, begging for your likes and views. It's like giving you guys an output with almost no craftsmanship involved. And I don't want to feed you guys with such low quality contents forever. You know, I wanna improve myself as much as you guys want me to improve. And that's why we're doing this. To all of you guys out there who watch and support my videos, well, I know this is a very generic YouTuber thing and I know I already said this a couple of times na. And it's getting cheesier and cheesier every time I say this but um, bahala na. Basta, I wouldn't be here without you all guys, you know. I mean, alam nyo na yan and I'm so thankful for that. Thank you so much, homies. <laughs> you know, there's so many times where I'm about to give up making videos. Like, there were times where it took months for me to upload again because I just don't feel like doing it. But um, we all know that if you really want something, then you really need to work for it. You really need to get out of your bed and just do it, whether you like the process or not. I mean, hassle is key. You guys know that no one is going to make that dream happen for yourself aside from yourself. Like, you know, there is no shortcuts, bro. There is no magic formula to grow here in YouTube. There is no genie who can do it for you in just a... Okay, I, I don't know how to do that. <laughs> I mean, at the end of the day, you still need to just do it. No matter how shitty your day is, you still need to put some effort for you to improve, for you to grow. Well, I'm not saying that this is the right thing to do. I mean, if you're lost in your 20s, then... Please do bear in mind, guys, that I just turned 21. So um, the things that you're intimidated at are pretty much the same things that I am trying to figure out right now. So basically, it's blind leading the blind in this one. After all, I'm no guru or mentor or any of the likes. I'm just a random nobody making some YouTube content here about me trying to figure out my purpose in this vast universe. Damn bro, lalim nun na Mariana Trench. <laughs> if any of you guys wanna start a YouTube channel or like planning to have one, well, my only advice is to create what you have at the moment and create the best out of it. You know, it's been my number one excuse for months. Like, um, ah, I'll make contents lang like this kapag arrange ko na yung mga gamit ko sa room. Or like, ah, I'll do the editing part na lang later kapag nakabili na ako ng hard drive. Or like, I don't do vlogging muna for now kasi like nasira yung DSLR ko or something like that, you know? I mean, I don't want you guys to stuck in there. I've been there. Take it from me. It doesn't feel great at all. You know, we all start from level 1. I mean, it doesn't really matter how far you can proceed in a given period of time. What matters most is that you're constantly moving. You're constantly doing something for you to level up. Years after, you just look back to your old videos and say, Hey self, I'm glad you started it. Take my old videos for example. I only use Android phones back then. And um, I even have videos that are vertically taken. My point here is like, start. That's it. I mean, just start. So yeah, I guess I've been talking here for so long na. So like, um, if you're still watching this right now, well... You reach the part where I'm just talking nonsense na lang. Kaya, thank you. I mean, maraming salamat. I really appreciate you all, guys. You know? This one is for the future me so that I have something to look back a year from now or like two years from now. Like, whoa, seriously? That's really me years ago? Parang ganun ba? Alright, I guess this is my last video na for 2020. To be honest, I have lots of pending videos pa, but... Yeah, I hope to see you guys next year. Maybe we're a bit late now for Christmas, but um, who cares? <laughs> Let's cheers pa rin. 
you know, Merry Christmas, guys. <laughs> Wait, baka mabasag. <laughs> that was a roller coaster year, and I know, guys, you feel the same. If you want to know more about me, feel free to follow me on Twitter and Instagram. I make updates there almost every day. And if you want to support me, guys, and like it, then feel free to follow me there and give my photos a max rate. <laughs> Thank you so much guys for watching and sana subaybayan nyo pa ako sa journey ng buhay ko. Bye! God bless everyone! Talk and talk and talk on how this channel is going so far. It's going, it's doing man!